So that's what we'll do on this call. This call we're going to run, it's called multiple ad creatives where you're using multiple images. You're running one ad, you're running, you're running one ad, $1 amount, one, one ad, but, but Facebook is now leveraging these five images images and your ad is shuffling as your ad runs it's shuffling through these different images to find the one that actually pops the one that yep. actually gives you the better return okay look i just noticed i need so, to i have a band-aid on my arm there i probably should delete that out you no that no it doesn't even matter it's all good no okay. one cares yeah not at all so so here's what we'll have to do though when you run multiple ad creatives you don't post it on the business page first so you can leave this here for sure but we'll just end up having to do it again but it won't it won't be on the page twice it'll just be running behind the scenes okay okay so so that's fine here but this is not going to be the ad it could be exactly the same text we'll just redo it we're going to just redo okay. it because we're going to have to run the the five images we're do we have pull to them run five do we have to run five we could do three it's up to you okay yeah let's do three i think but but at the same time it, it the more the better because again facebook's gonna gonna break down and show you the one that works so okay. at the end of it you're only going to be running it on one actually you're okay. going to be running on the winning one. You know what I mean? Okay. Gotcha. So, so we'll run it for a few days to find the one out of five image that actually is the one performing. And then we shut off the other ones. Okay. And only that one image runs because that outperformed the other five or other four. You know what I mean? Okay. So, so perfect. So let's, let's go ahead and leave this here. Cause we're gonna have to come back here and grab that text. Cause I want to use okay. the same exact text, but actually, you know what? Let's go over this text real quick before you leave. Let's go click on see more. Hi guys, I wanted to tell you about a call I just got from a client, Jessica, who bought a house with me in the Austin area about nine years ago. She wanted to tell me about her plan to improve her and her family's lives. What a smart lady. Read below to learn the rest of the story. Awesome. Okay, so actually, you know what? We could take out read below to learn. To really? read, yeah, we could take that part out. Um, we won't do it this second. Let me, let me, read, the, let me read the rest real quick. Okay. We, we won't do it this second, but um, yeah, we don't really need that part. I could find it again. Oh, yeah, Just yeah, hit the yeah. back, hit the back button. Yeah, see if that works. I did that and it didn't. Okay, okay. I'm gonna go here. Why we're, uh, yeah. Where the capital I needs to go. So, and then we could, yeah, let's take out the read below to learn. Yes. And then we'll just, it just continues. So what a smart lady. Jessica just realized that this, realized this current market might provide the perfect opportunity for her family to live a simpler life. She said, she said her husband works from home and can work anywhere. And Jessica said, why am I staying in this high pressure job away from my kids all week long? I don't wanna be in this rat race anymore, please help. I ran numbers for her and determined her equity to be at 300K. Jessica decided to sell, sell now and move to the country where she can, we're preparing to sell her house and have fun few properties, found a few properties that would work for her family. How can, how can I help you fulfill your dreams? Click learn more. To download my p click learn more so let's take away take away how can i help how can i help um yeah, yeah. fulfill your dreams take that part out yeah you can leave the icon leave the little emoji okay. but just put it at the end of maybe maybe her family or yeah okay. put it up put it up at the end of of her okay. family you just hit the backspace or you could drag it oh that's weird yeah i didn't know i could but oh wow. I did, i've never so. seen that yeah i didn't know i could well there we go. Oh, wow. That's cool. Okay. Yeah. So then um, click learn more to download, click learn more to download the same PDF Jessica read prior to me helping her sell her home or something like that, right? Click learn more to download the same information guide I gave to Jessica or click learn more to download the same information, inf the same um, information. Well, information, information not. No. Click God. on more to download the same informational guide I gave Jessica. Okay, that's on good. things to consider before selling your home. Perfect. Yeah, that sounds good. Awesome. Okay, so 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 again, you can save it, but this is not going to be the ad. Normally, it would be. It would be the I'll ad. Save it so we have it. Yeah, just so we have it. So again, normally it would be the ad if we were only <laughs> running this one image, this one ad. But since you have several images, let's do that. Let's put them all in the mix and okay. see which one performs, you know? Sure. Um, yeah, so that'd be fun. So, okay. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go to, let's go to the ads manager and let's just, let's just start from there. We'll just click the green button and, um, and set up a new, a new conversions ad. And 
So I'm going to the dashboard. Yes, the dashboard. Perfect. And I'm going to the green button. What? Mm -hmm. Yes. Now always make sure we're in the right account. So that's the right account oh, right at the top. I don't I'm pretty know. sure it is. Close. Where would I see it? Will I see it here? Go ahead and uh, just X on the top left. I'm pretty sure we are, but yeah, just hit close. So Austin's Boutique Realtor. Okay, yeah. perfect. So let's go, let's just go back to that same one. Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. So you always want to double check that, but yeah. just your box is checked. So right there. So you're good. No, no, no. X out. Oh, I don't have to start again. Okay. No, you, you already have it open. Click so just edit. This, edit from here. It. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So perfect. Would... And, and let's just go, let's, let's, let's start naming our videos. Let's start naming our images, just giving it a certain name. Just so when we come over here, we can just list that name. So image in blue shirt or whatever like okay jessica jessica's listing or jessica's yeah, yeah whatever is going to help you yeah with you could do that with, with blue shirt and then in parentheses conversions wow yeah so right here go housing and then we'll just scroll down conversions and then um we'll name them as we go you could just scroll down and leave um the campaign that budget auction should i leave it like no that? leave it leave it. every all that stays the that same conversion matter. scroll down and then that's off okay and then next and then over here um is when we'll set up um actually it's either here or the, or the third one but it's where we'll put on I'm okay yeah it's right here so go to name it you can name it um and in fact you know what what you're going to name it is yeah jessica um but you're going to name it, um um the amount of images so blue oh, shirt, really? blue shirt. Yeah, no, not blue shirt. You don't need that this, because you did on the, that on the first step. Okay. The second step, you can name it, um, name it, name it um, five image ad or three image ad or um, however good. many we're going to put three. Yeah, okay, I'm not so, sure. Yeah, three images. Three. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Okay, so website and then turn on dynamic creative. Turn on that one. So that's this provide creative elements. So go ahead and hit continue. Um, okay. Okay, so so right here, provide creative elements such as images and headlines, and we'll automatically generate combinations optimized for your audience. Wow. So That's variations cool. may include different formats or templates based on one or more elements. So so in this case, with that turned on, we can use multiple images and we can even use multiple headlines. Multiple headlines would be nice. Yeah, yeah we're going to do both. No, we're, we're always saying learn. Uh, click to learn more yeah, so yeah maybe putting something different would be smart yeah for sure this is where we can test okay so so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna um we're gonna simply go 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 lifetime budget and what i want you to do is drop it down lower i mean excuse me daily we're gonna stay at daily we're gonna stay at daily oh, okay. and, and, and just go down to go down to go down to go down to ten dollars a day okay go down to ten dollars a day and then let's just start that ad for tomorrow let's start it tomorrow at 6 a.m won't let me change it yeah now it will okay perfect 6 a.m and then we won't put us we won't put an end date because i want to i want to manage this one with you so i'll look at it in a few okay. days with you Great. um and then and then um we won't we won't retarget any custom audiences we'll um we'll just keep going down so we'll change the location and then um we'll always make sure people living in so go ahead and edit and then people living in you'll always want to hit that drop down right and go with the you know in this location and then yeah and then let's change out the united states put in your city and then or Is your address right? am i doing it right yeah yeah I think so. so now we'll just scroll down we'll leave the age we'll leave the gender and um, you just can't change that because of the housing category that we're in. So we'll right. leave that as is. And then the detail targeting, leave it off. Languages, go ahead and put English. Let's at least narrow down the language. So Where we'll go the... oh, here. We'll go edit on the language and go English. And then this, um, let's leave it, we'll leave it automatic placement. We'll leave it on automatic placement. Scroll down and then um, we're, we're done. So go next. Okay, cool. So now, now that dynamic creative was turned on as we get to the third and final step, this is where we'll add the, um, the images. Okay. Um, but you know what, go back, click on Jessica three image, click on that real quick to the left. 
yeah, right there. And then go back, go back, scroll down. We chose the conversion event, right? So the conversion event, scroll down, scroll down, yeah, scroll down. Good. So go this, could, be, this yeah. could for sure just be the newest, newest version of it. So just hit next. That's okay. the first step. And then we go to the second one. Normally you'll see your pixel and custom conversion right here, but for some reason we're not, and that's fine. Turn on dynamic creative. Let's just go through it. Dynamic creative, turn that back on. And then um, continue, and then just go ahead and scroll down. So all that's fine, Add your, uh, targeting. Okay, cool, and then hit next, and that's it. So let's just, let, we'll just go through and continue. Okay. So right here, that's fine, the Instagram, that's okay. So go ahead and name, name the title, new ad. Go ahead and name that something. You can name it the same as the top, Jessica ad with blue shirt, same thing. Or maybe even just put image, you know, image. Actually, no, you already have three image, so that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, it doesn't even matter. Okay, cool. So we'll scroll down. And then all we're going to do right here is select images. So we're going to click that. I, I don't know if I've got them all on this computer. No, you're going to upload them. So okay, all you're going to do to the very, very right, click on upload and just upload yeah, those but images. I don't know that I've got them all here. I'm going to have to move them probably. Oh, you don't have them on your computer? No, they, oh, okay. I don't know why they don't. It takes days for them to go on there for some reason. But it doesn't take me long to... Um, yeah, let me see. This one. Maybe whatever images you have then of of, of, of have similar that. to that other one. I think I have two. I only have two. Okay. Let's let's use the two then. All right. Where are the images on your cell phone? No, they're on here. The two are on here. Okay. Let me get to photos. So I need to get to photos. Where are my photos? Maybe in window. I want we'll do to those two. To Let's do another one. That other one that I just, I know I downloaded it. Just a second. Let me see. Just click um, upload from here. Where? Right there. Yeah. And then go into your. Awesome. So let's open that. One, I think. And so let's no, go ahead and. and um, That's good. We said three images. So mm -hmm. why is this one got a thing? Um, maybe because it's too, it might be, it might be too big, but we'll find or out. It could be too small. Cause I did adjust that for one of my emails that I did. That's not 1680 by two, by two, 2048. That's not, I that, think it is. Yeah, I yeah, think that, it is. I adjusted it, but I think that's what I adjusted it to. Okay. Do you so want then, to put one more just in case? Yeah. Do another one just in case. Okay. Those three with the blue shirt. I want to use this one right here. Yeah. We're going to oh, use you those mean three. The three with the blue shirt. Okay. Yes, that has the triangle too. Um, I think I it might be the dimension. One I get adjust. That's I fine. Continue. Yep. Control, hold them down, continue. And now we got all three. So now we got now we got these three. So all we're going to do is we can scroll, scroll down. Can we move? Then, can I put one of the others first? That's my least. Well, favorite. it doesn't matter. Oh, Facebook's going to shuffle it. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Okay. Facebook is going to shuffle it. So primary text. Should we go back one? to the old one? Copy the entire text and just bring it over here. Okay. Awesome. Uh, okay. Cool. So. Where'd it go? Okay. okay. Perfect. Okay. Cool. So we'll bring that over. Um, and then what we can also do, go ahead and put that in primary text. What we can do is instead of, scroll to the very bottom of that, right there where it says click learn more. Yeah, the bottom, the last sentence, maybe that can be uh -oh. the headline. So right okay. yeah, maybe take it out of there. Yeah. Isn't it long? Yeah, let's, let's, let's try to condense it. Let's try to, let's try to shorten that. That should be the headline. Click learn more to download your free seller guide. That's it. Instead of saying the same yeah, thing. Instead of saying all that, yeah. <laughs> Click learn more to download your free seller guide. No, not right there in the headline. <gasps> oh, oh, okay. Uh oh, one second. My free seller's guide. Yeah. To get my free seller's guide. To get your free seller guide. Yours. Perfect. And then, and then just clean up that bottom, that sentence that last. Hi guys. Yeah. Take that one out. Oh gosh. Thanks. I'm glad you saw that. I didn't notice it. Okay. Perfect. So, so now you have the ability to do it again, like add another, another option. 
another so, headline. Yeah, another headline another and thing. another text. So again, let's go to the top, start from the top to bottom. So we have this primary text. And mm -hmm. then if you click on add another option, go ahead and click on that. Now go ahead and paste that in again and let's change it up. So actually do uh, the full, happen. yeah. Yeah. So just go ahead and just this is what you call split testing. Like this is split testing. It's split testing the Good. image and it's split testing the text and the headline. This is split testing. So another form of split testing is when you're when you're targeting multiple ad sets, but you're mm -hmm. not you're not doing that. We're doing multiple ad creatives is what we're doing. Change it to everyone. Hey everyone. Perfect. Exactly. So now you're gonna just tweak it a little bit. Um and, and put maybe put a space in between that. Hi everyone, and I wanted. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. And then um, maybe take out that bottom sentence. Click learn more to download your, take that out. Let's um, shorten this one. It's fine. Yeah, okay. So hit enter, bring it back, bring that cursor up, get rid of that blank space. So hit backspace, backspace. And then, um, okay, so you're good there. So maybe one other headline. Let's just do one other headline. Um, Oh, where so, do I? Oh, here, add another option. Yep. Yeah, I'm thinking we need another headline. So, so, um, how about on this one say, um, let me help you make your dream come true? Perfect. Perfect. Put it. And then maybe click. Learn more. Perfect. No, that's all. That's all. You don't need to click. No, that, that's it. Perfect. Right, the, Perfect. The ad will say it itself. Yeah. Perfect. So we got two different variations of the text. We got two different headlines. We got three images. Perfect. So scroll back up. Let's just. We don't have to make any more variations of the text. We don't have to. We can. No. We can go one more if you want. No. It's totally up to you, but that's happy. fine. So now we'll scroll down, scroll down. Now the website URL, that's your, your um, landing page, your link. So go ahead and grab your Kartra, your landing page link. Right, yeah. Oh, right here is where I'm going to put it? No, up. Mm. Scroll up. You see the red. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's your website URL. So that's okay. your website. That's your landing page, website URL. Right. So always remember that part. And then um, they click learn more and go straight to that page. Let's grab this link here and... and Put it and, in the other. Yes. Okay. Okay. So we're going to paste that in there. And then that is it. So the learn more button, the call to action button, that's already there. Okay. So now um, it'll populate to the right. We'll there? see different images oh, there. Wow. Cool. And so now we're going to publish. Wait, I only see the one image. No, it's going to shuffle through. So. Oh. Yeah, so you're fine. We're fine. So don't hit publish. I don't see that crooked image anywhere. Yeah, they're just showing us the one image. Oh, okay. But as it runs, normal. we'll start to see the numbers on all of them. Okay. Okay, so hit publish and, and you're good. So Ooh. let that run. Let that run. That should that should approve. There's nothing about that that should not approve. So so we shouldn't have any yeah. worries. That ad publish should go live tomorrow. Wow. And then just... um. Let it let's now you look think at I'll see it? because of errors. Okay, let's look at this error real quick. View details. Let's see what this was. Jessica, pixel required. Attracting pixels required. Okay, so let's just hit hit done. Let's look at this pixel real quick. Okay, perfect. So we got all that tracking. Click on that, check that box, website events. Where? above above right above right there that box oh. website events perfect that was it okay so now publish publish i hope so i hope that was it yeah yeah that 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 had to have been it that um okay. yeah bam that was it so it. so Got now it. now we had a we had to check that box that was very weird normally you wouldn't have to check that box really normally okay. it's already checked like it's by default it's oh. checked uh -huh. so, Maybe because it's this kind of ad. So, so the only thing that 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 it, that I, that I would think is some kind of crazy, like super super, as in as in ten minutes ago type of update, was mm. the fact that on the second level, which is the ad set level, yeah. Normally, we see the pixel and the conversion event. 
right? Yeah. But we didn't it. see that. We didn't see yeah. that. So that's the only thing. The ad is is in review. It's it's going to get approved good. and everything is good. But but that's the only thing that I'm concerned about. So oh, yes, let it so run. It still be a hiccup. No, I'm just I'm just maybe it's maybe because of the new iOS update and and because of the events manager, like maybe because they already know what we're shooting for. So for example, yeah. go to the left, click on the three three lines, go to events manager, and then go to um go to um um um, 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 um. we're gonna we're gonna click on aggregated event measurement. So if you just scroll down the middle of the page. Click on um, aggregated we'll event go. measurement. So right there, new. Yep. Click on that. Scroll down. Click on the blue button, and then um, I'm thinking that click on the number one, and then manage or edit whatever it says. Click on right it. here. Yep. Okay. Click configure and manage event. events. So because we have this set up, click on edit. Because we have this in because we have this set up is why mm -hmm. I'm thinking we didn't see it over there because Facebook already knows what we're optimizing for. They already know this web configuration. They already know that that's the, that's, that's the conversion. So okay. that's what I'm thinking. Maybe is the reason why we didn't see it at the ad set level. So let this run and, and let's review this ad in exactly four days. Okay. okay so I'm gonna, I'm gonna set it up right now. And then Tuesday, um, maybe when we do it again, We'll um, let, let, let's talk Saturday. My calendar is open for Saturday. Saturday. Let's talk Saturday. Schedule a call for Saturday. Okay. Let this and run till I, Saturday. And then maybe we can do the Instagram too if it's easy. Oh yeah, 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 for sure. We'll do that. But let, let's don't have it that far, dude. Let's let's um actually that's oh, Sunday. I'm sorry. So you let's did. um. Saturday we'll see. Yeah. Do you think I'll see it at all on my timeline? Um, you can force the, the, the C, but I don't know if, yeah, I don't know. I did it. Let's, let, let's look at it. Let's just look at a quick snapshot of it real quick. So go to the, go to the, go to the, the ad or go to the events manager and click on um, the three lines to the left, go back to the ads manager. As far as you being targeted and, and actually seeing the ad in real time, there's a great chance. Cause that's, that's the address closest to you. So, but again, it's all, it's all based on the budget. So I don't know if you'll see it, but click on ads manager. Okay, it's all right if I don't. Click on Ads Manager, and then and then just check the box to the left of the blue dot, and then click on the last tab. Let's just um, let's see if it, it it might just show us one image. So check the box to the left of the blue sir, blue dot. Did I do the right thing? And just okay. check the box to the blue left of the blue dot. So that ad, check that box. Oh, this one. Okay. And then click on the the third tab to the right ads for one ad campaign for one campaign. Yeah. Click on that one and then click on edit right below the title, Jessica ad image. And let's just Here, look at no, it right below no, the title. No, be, oh, yeah, okay. Edit right there. So now to the very, very right, just hit that drop down next to view more variations. Yeah. Hit that. And then just go to desktop newsfeed. So Facebook desktop newsfeed. See a carousel is very different because a carousel and a lot of real estate agents do that. They'll run an ad or they'll post something and they'll have, they'll have five images all in a, all in a carousel, right? Yeah, yeah. This uh, yeah, is I not know. a carousel. Right. So okay. this is where Facebook is literally shuffling behind the scenes mm -hmm. to show you, to, to show the best image. Go back. What, go back. Do I want to be back to me, not this. This is not where we're at. We wanted to see the ad. Go, go back to the other one, the other tab, number eight. No, no, no. Oh. X out of this one. You hit X the out drop of down. X, X, out of, of X out of this tab. Yeah. X out of this tab. You clicked on the drop down. Go to the drop okay. down. You clicked on desktop newsfeed. So view it from this tab. So click on that from here, not your business page. So from oh. right here, scroll down and you'll see you'll see that ad. Really? Okay. Slow down, slow down. There it is. And it's so it's showing you one image, everyone. yeah, and that's fine. So click on learn more. Let me help you make your dreams come true. I like that. I think so that's, that's one be a good title. You know, click on learn more. You know, you always want to test the link and make sure it takes you know takes you to the page. So boom. So right here, bam. There's your landing page. Right. Cool. So let yeah. that run. Let's chat Saturday. 
and okay. let's look at the numbers and, and, and we'll have, we should have enough data on which image is the, is the top producing one. And that's really? what we leave on. And, tell us, huh? Yeah. Oh yeah. We're going to look at the numbers. Anxious to see that. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yay. Thank, Thank you. Christine. Have a great one. I'll talk to you Saturday. You okay. Sounds okay. good. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye.